Good evening, everyone. Along with Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich, and an air of expectancy about this game because when you walk through the turnstiles and you go up to your seat, you know you're going to get to see the top point getter in the league, and that's a thrill. Who doesn't love to see goals and points, Doc? And when you have the leading scorer in the entire league on the ice, he's going to get a lot of attention from the other team's best defensive players. We direct our attention to the Nets and the starting goalies. He remains number one despite sporting a loss last time out. He's getting the call, and it's done with confidence. Let's see if he can own the crease for the Flames. The referee has checked. The goal lights work. Let's see if anybody can light them. Henrik sent to the big center ice circle for the Stars. Scarbos is his opposite number for Calgary. Things are heating up with that hit. Well, we expected a physical game, Doc, and it looks like he's on a mission trying to set the tone for... In all alone. Score! That is point number 100 this year for him. This is a memorable season for him, Doc. With that goal, he's hit the 100-point plateau. Now that the scoring's been opened up, we'll see if the opponent can punch their way back into this game. You can't be back on your heels too long. And in the very first minute, it's 1-0. That's the way you start a hockey game, and you love it as a visiting team. Calgary's prevailed again on the faceoff of the neutral zone. They score! Alex Petrovich, assisted by number 17, Michael Scarboza. Time of the goal, one minute. The shooter had a couple of different options here. He could pass or shoot. He decided on the latter and beat the goaltender clean. And so sometimes your best isn't enough. That is a perfect shot up over the glove hand. The goaltender just was not able to get to it. The Flames control from the faceoff. Drives ahead. What a big breakaway stop. Off the iron. The goalies will tell you that's their best. I haven't seen a lot of this, Doc, after whistles. Let's keep an eye on this type of play. It might lead to something else. Fleury's totally blown him off here. He may fight another time. Not now. The Flames prevailing on the faceoff. Right along the line. Perfect tip by the stick. Moving it to Henrique. Terrific open ice hit. The defense can rest. Unfortunately, the puck carrier there knows he's in a hockey game. Wow, what a collision. Fires! Hits the post! The real chore is not to be frustrated. Even though they're up here, they could have spread this lead out and maybe coasted home. He'd been focused on this milestone a little bit. He talked about wanting to achieve it as soon as possible. Now he's done it. Just under four minutes skated here in the first. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. Calgary's quick on the draw. Scorch is one. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Big drive. Calgary's setting up an offense from the wing. Puck grab, they're ready to go. Shoots, blocked. Got to clear it. Tried, but it didn't work. They're getting ready to strike. A wonderful scoring chance denied. Setting it up. They score! That's three unanswered goals. You're not going to see many shots harder than that. What a play. Bishop's only able to move so quickly. What a shot.
They've won the faceoff. He's in! Comes up big on the breakaway. Scooped up by Alexander Ovechkin. A goalie goes in traveling, looks to make a pass. The Flames with the puck heading up ice from the board. Just like shootout. If you don't want to spend 10 minutes and decides to just hold on and get a stop to play. New parking area, and a seemingly can't be denied as one of the highest goal scorers in the league. He is checked very tightly, but he's always able to grab a half a stride away from his defender and get his stick on the puck. Big drive. Outstanding offense met by solid goaltending. Nice face-off win. Puck ricocheted off the screen. Great point-blank save. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. In score! And that's four straight goals. Kunakel's body position was key to be able to snap this one home. And so everybody's heading north. The puck turns around and heads south back towards the goal. The goalie just can't handle this shot. Calgary's won that faceoff and possession established. They score! Eight minutes, 19 seconds. This puck jumped off his stick. He scored on the one-timer. Bishop's glove's just not quick enough to catch this one, Edzo. He dropped into the butterfly expecting a low shot, but the shooter made a nice one up over his shoulder. And the face-off's won. Alone! He scores! Second of the game! What a performance! Number four, Hayden Flurry. Time of the goal, 8 minutes, 33 seconds. Oh, he looked confident on that breakaway right before he scored. Bishop's opened up a little bit of room here by making himself smaller, but this is a perfect shot. Star Goalie to the opening. bench, substitution Number made. 30, well, it was pretty Bishop. clear a little a while ago in this game that this was not going to turn out Golden. well. He has not had a very good night. The coach looks like he's clearly fed up with it. And while the team has played very poorly, the number one way to change the game is to take your goalie out. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. Here it comes! Score! He's got his second of the game. Flurry. Time of the goal. Eight minutes, 51 seconds. What a beautiful pass to set up this one-timer. Hudobin's a goaltender that can be beaten up over the shoulders. He closes down the bottom of the net, Edzo, but this time they beat him up over his shoulders right near the elbow. Just over nine minutes have been played. Calgary's offense is just overwhelming now, piling up the goals. Neutralized face-off win. In the slot! Did not get anything up. That shot hit a man. Smart recovery. Score! It's a hat trick!
Ennis gave the goaltender no time to react with that quick snapshot. He tries to snare this and put a little mustard on it. He doesn't get it, and it's in the net. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Breaks away. He shuts it right down. Time of the goal. And freezes play or the whistle. Anytime you get near a benchmark, you want to achieve it as quickly as possible. He was able to get it done. He can feel some satisfaction in that. Calgary's got it again. No! Gotta get it on net. Ripped it, but ripped it just past the net. You gotta hit the net on that opportunity. Calgary's got it in their own end, hoping for center. Fires. He scores! Number 40. What a gem this team has found in this rookie. 40 goals in season number one. You could tell he's worked on this shot before because that's such a quick release, and he snaps it home. And so he's in good position here, but the shooter's known to be a real accurate shooter. He doesn't have much room, and he doesn't miss it. Calgary's got that one. Now what? With the pace, he's been... Score! And for him, that's his 40th goal. Brock Fetzer, and by number seven, Tucker Kuhlman. Time of the goal, 11 minutes, 18 seconds. I promise you one thing, the coaches are going to show that extra effort play tomorrow. And so we see this all the time. The goaltender thinks he's in perfect position, so he drops down to spread out, and the puck beats him up over the glove. Calgary's got that neutral zone faceoff. Scored by number 20, Thomas Yurko. Let's it go. Great save. Oh, he was lucky to make that stop off that screenshot. Calgary's been an offensive juggernaut led by this player who has among the highest points totals in the league. He's a dangerous player, remarkably skilled on the power play. The Flames win that faceoff. At least he protected his goaltender. Terrific determination by Shen. That puck belongs to a fan somewhere. That is out of play. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. <laughs> Critical face-off win there. Collected by Shen. A terrific scoring chance denied. A point blast. Great save. Terrific chance there, but the pass fails. Calgary skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. Shoots. May not have intended it, but it hit him. Intercepts that pass. Maybe he can generate something. Gains the zone. Didn't get a thing of that one. The Stars lug the puck in the defensive zone. Pitching it to Klingberg. Pass ahead. He's nudged off by the defense. Gathered up again by Shen. Fires and a save. Nice work by Shen. The Flames have the puck at center ice. Breakaway! Score! And for him, that is a big 4-0 in the goal column. Well, the goaltender wants to be aggressive here, but this is just perfectly delivered.
Neutral zone face off one. Possession established here. Play is stopped. Net detached. We'll put it back on and get ready to go again. Thomas Yurko. Time of the goal, 17 minutes, 42 seconds. Solid win at center ice. Now what? Got it in the slot. Fires. Wonderful stop. Save. Outstanding body contact. Right above the goalie's shoulder off the crossbar. Fires. The shot blocked. Didn't handle it very well. Free puck. To the last 17. Throws it. Seven showing on the clock. Waits with it. Big shot from the point. That move not too slick there. And the period comes to a close. Wow, what a finish. Fans, your donations have made it possible for kids in need to see their heroes live from our Tickets for Kids Luxury Box. Thank you for your generosity. The stars are suffering on the goaltender. For him, there are great days, there are average days, and then there's today. More in a moment. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What impressed you most? Dallas won't feel good about their performance so far. They're trailing on the scoreboard, and their time of possession is a big part of that. They'll need to get the puck on their sticks if they want to generate scoring chances in the second. Can he beat him here? Stands his ground on the breakaway. Puck held near the point. Got that in the trapper. Worst thing can happen is a face wash. You do that, you're looking for some trouble. Calgary's got another win. Score! I don't think anyone saw this puck come off his stick. It blew past everyone and into the net. Oh, he puts everything into this. He launches a rocket past the goaltender who doesn't even move. Calgary is just continuing to hammer away on the shot board enormous, and the score is large. And they've won the faceoff. Scored by number four. A big one-timer. Score! He's got the hat trick. And listen, the only ones you can hear are his teammates. A snapshot is in between a slap shot and a wrist shot, and that is textbook snapshot hockey. He finds the back of the net. I don't know how he could be in much better position, Eddie. I got a clean look at this. That is a perfectly placed shot. Calgary's got a large lead in this game. Let's see if they can build on it or whether they'll start to get conservative. He keeps winning draws, and his team gets possession, and they're winning the game. I wonder if there's a connection there. Takes it right back. Fires! That hit somebody. Great block! Picked up by the defense. Knocked off the puck. Steps across that line. A superb hit. A great hockey play there. I wonder if that hit will change the momentum of this game. That is up close and personal. Chickering's going to have to pick himself up after that one. He got steamrolled. They've clearly got the target on him. Watch out, a big hit. One way to wear down your opponent, play physical. That's exactly what happened there. A shot, score! When you're in the low slot and a puck's on the backhand, you got to react quickly. This always looks like a shot that I think should be stopped. It's below the glove, just above the pad. 
Calgary has got an enormous lead, and it's in the second period. Hopefully, they don't go daydreaming now. The Flames prevail on the draw. By number 11, Big chance! Assisted by number 14, Rock Spencer. Not a free puck now. What a tremendous hit! Now it's directed to Klingberg. And the pickup. Puck loose, strong defensive play by Kessler. Trying to fight his way to the front. Out in front. Great glove save. Strong wrister. Save there. That defuses the attack for now. There are a few. Richie's looking for some trouble here. Hurry up. Oh, you don't go after the star without paying a price. And the fight ends with one resounding punch. You don't see too many fights end on that note. The Stars with a face-off win. Tremendous hit. Yurko's skill is known throughout the league, but when he throws his body around, everybody takes notice. Wonderful save. <laughs> Hammers one, and on top of that, another great stop. The Flames always want to play a physical game, and their leader is right here. He always has among the highest hit totals in the league. He is a pinball on ice. Calgary has got that face-off win. Great glove hand. Huge hit, possession's gone. If you can catch somebody with an open ice hit, you know that you're giving them a real jolt. Couldn't retain possession. The Stars have played half of this game, and none of it has been any good. They look at the clock, and they wonder why it's not moving faster. They want out. Gathered up again by Ovechkin. Pitching this one to Kunakel. Onside. One-timer. Score! The key to this goal on the one-timer, hands away from the body and follow through. Just too quickly, Edzo down on his knees into the butterfly that opens up the top of the net, and the shot beats him up over the stick side. The Flames have built an enormous lead, and we're still in the second period. Calgary's got that puck off the draw. That puck's loose. Good defense. Shoots. Score! He's got his second. Number eight, Alexander Ovechkin. Time of the goal, 10 minutes, 19 seconds. The goaltender had no chance stopping that puck with the quick release. He looked like he was guessing a little bit there, Edzo, as he drops into the butterfly position. Not enough of the net covered. The Flames have gotten another goal on a night of many goals. What a satisfying night for them, and their coach won't have much to say. Brings a shot, got in front of another one. Now that's a timely save, a beautiful one. Oh, he saw the window open, but he didn't even touch the curtain. Boy, this puck had a lot of steam on it, but unfortunately, he turned his hands over, and that's what caused the puck to miss the net badly. Pass attempt to Wotherspoon. Oh, what a hit that one was. He did not expect to get hit right there. That is a big hit. Right near the line. Shoots. The pad came in handy that time. Brings it in for an attack. That puck hit him on the way to the net. He hangs on and gets the whistle. The game was close until this bout, and then the emotion just completely seemed to swing over one way to the other. His team has grabbed the momentum and dominated the game since.
Calgary's got that win. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Off a defender, that's a free puck. The Stars carrying it in their own end. Huge open ice hit. That is a massive open ice hit. They look spectacular. They feel great when you deliver them. They don't feel so great when you're lying where he is. That shot came from right in front. He's locked in now. Great save. At the point with it. Can't get a shot on it. Pressure now. Out of the blue line. Lifts it. He scores. Second of the game. What a performance. Oh, that shot was heavy and dangerous. Good thing it didn't hit anybody. Well, there's the old brain cramp. You turn the puck over in that position, your goalie's not going to have much chance. He gets beat up high here. The Flames have built a tremendous lead here in the second period. Not a lot of time left, but an entire third ahead. Perhaps they can enlarge it even more. Crosses that line. Shot. Lightning in that glove. Fires. Stop. And that, for him, is a milestone goal number 30 this year. When you're an offensive player and you have that much time, you're allowed to take that big, heavy slap shot. Fortunately for the offensive team, they're rewarded with a big goal. That just about took off the goalie's ear. Perfect shot right in the top of the net. Calgary's getting a larger and larger lead as the second period gets shorter and shorter. And a full third period and a chance to enlarge. Steps in from the neutral zone. Score! Assisted by number 11, Kyle Connor, and by number 50, Turner Elson. Time of the goal, 17 minutes, 4 seconds. He is right there in the low slot and doesn't waste any time snapping that home. Hudobin sprawled out to make a desperation attempt on this. Nice try, just couldn't get there. Calgary's lead is already enormous. Will they just sit on this now and get the horn at the end of the second? And they take that neutral zone face off. Couldn't get his way through. Back on his stick. Has it picked up. Continuing in neutral ice. He's in on an onside play. Great save. Hangs on to that one for a stoppage in play. Calgary's aggressive forechecking has been a key to this period. Every time their opponent has the puck, they get a body on them, and as a result, they've scored goals to take the lead. That's a solid face-off win. Puck ricocheted off the screen. One minute left. Into the last minute of the second period. Able to attack now. Glides along the line. He wore that puck on a hard shot. That was one he'll get the number on. I'm not sure if his coach wants him playing like that. Well, they got to be a little tired after these first two periods of play, so they'll get a rest as we start to think ahead toward period number three. We turn now to the shots on goal at the end of two. 56 for the Flames and none for Dallas. Are you looking for information? Dallas has a lot to talk about during the intermission, and it shows on the scoreboard. They've got troubles, and the goaltender has even more, as you see from this example. We'll return after these words. We are entering the third period. Based on the first two, what are you expecting to happen? Calgary's performance has been stellar coming into the third. I would expect more of the same rather than trying to protect the lead against a desperate hockey team. Third period underway, and though any... He scores! Yet again, a big night gets even larger.
When you're thinking about taking a wrist shot, it's all about weight transfer. Transferring your weight from your back foot to your front foot when you're shooting that puck. That's exactly what happened there. Outstanding shot. He had the puck on his stick for just a second before he delivered it right up into the top of the net. Calgary's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. Good grab again. Moves it to the corner. And ripped to Fleury. Canes that offensive line. Score! He's got his second of the game. Well, he had a lot of time and space there to let that wicked shot go from far out. That is a heavyweight shot. That's a perfect shot. He's got a little bit of room, and he sticks it upstairs, top bins. Calgary's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. The Flames win that neutral zone faceoff. A solo rush. He scores. And for him, that's his 20th of this season. Petrovich. Time of the goal, 1 minute 32 seconds. He looked to be cherry picking in behind the defense, and it worked. He found himself on a breakaway. Goalies always look surprised when they get beaten by a backhand. A lot of times it's the quick release, maybe an unorthodox position that they're in as the puck sails by them. Calgary's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. The Flames are lugging it back through the defensive end. Gains the blue line. Biggest chance of the game. Time of the goal. One minute. Lifts one. Didn't get through. Turn a shot on net. Right near the line. Can he keep it going? Off the goal post. Calgary's back in its own end, trying to work forward. Big hit, possession gone. Just when he thought he had some open ice, he ran into a stop sign. That's got to hurt. Shoot, he was standing in the lane and got some of it. Hammered. Hatchets one. Block. At the point with a hard shot. They've got all the gunners out. Score! Off the iron and in. Thankfully, that shot did not hit the goaltender because that thing was labeled. I'd like to see every shot go off the goal post and into the net. There are too many that hit the post and go out. This one hits and goes in. Calgary's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. And you thought open ice hitting was gone. Fires one. Oh, it seemed like a great opportunity. Boy, that puck was really humming off the stick. Unfortunately, it missed the net badly. What a ripper. Score. He's got his second. That shot was all about speed. That was a nasty shot. The speed of this is too much for the goalie, Eddie. He's in position. He just can't catch up to it. Calgary's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. Calgary goal. 
Flames win the draw. What's next? Gathered up by Sidney Crosby. A shot! He got his pad on it! Time of the goal. Seven minutes, 26 seconds. Flings it! He scores! Second of the game! What a performance! He shot that puck so hard, I only saw it when it finally came back out of the net. Once the turnover's made, too many guys are heading one direction. The dangerous man is behind them, and it's a perfect shot inside the post. Calgary's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. Flame goal. Gets across, looks over his options. Time of the goal, 8 minutes, 25 seconds. A howitzer! And a save. And here again is Ray. Goodrow's passed some feathery dishes across the ice tonight. When his teammates get open, he's been able to find them in the right spot at the right time. He's been impossible to miss out there, Ray. Calgary's got it. Wonderful save. If they move the net into the corner, maybe that hard shot's got it. He scores off the crossbar. Crosby's slap shot goal would have been pulled over for speeding. That sound is jarring down here on the ice as it hits the bar and goes into the net. Calgary's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. He just fanned on it. The Stars have control of the puck in their own end. Enormous collision. He might have seen him at the last minute to absorb that hit. Shoots one. Uh, you could get a look at this from where I'm standing. This puck deflects off the goaltender and goes up over the glass. And yet again, here is Ray Ferraro. Always the reason you hit is to separate body from puck. Because he's been so physical, he's turned the puck over several times tonight. Okay, Ray, he is a special player to watch. An important face-off for his team. Score! The hat trick! It's not really loud in here, but they don't expect that. Flurry's big time slap shot goes in from the high slot. Whoa, it looks like his trapper's got a hole in it there, Ed, so he gets beat low to the glove side. Calgary's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. They win the draw win and the will score. now set up an attack. Fifth, fifth of the season. Scored by number four, Keaton Flurry. Assisted by number seven. Skill play. Wow, Michael look at him. He's got a long way to go. Does he have enough gas? Good job. He rubbed him right out. Udobin's able to handle this one. Gathered up again by Flurry. Calgary is gliding along through the neutral zone. It scores! He just keeps adding to a memorable night with another goal.
I don't think anyone saw this puck come off his stick. It blew past everyone and into the net. Sometimes the puck just sounds hard when the shooter unloads it, Eddie. The goalie was in good position, but this whistled past him. He didn't even move. Calgary's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. By number 17, in the slot. By number 20, Thomas Yurko. Puck out of the zone, and so they'll regroup. Dogged determination there by Fleury. Hammers one. Tay. Look at how active the goaltender is looking around the screen to try to make the stop. Dallas is going to want to keep things rolling by putting a W alongside these next three games. The coach has been hammering home the game plan, Doc, and success will be largely dependent on their execution at this point. Let's it go. That's a great save. Has it in his own end. Carries it on in from center. Score! And that for him is the big 5-0, a 50-goal season. And that's one to remember. Number 50 on the season. You got to think that puck's going to end up on his mantle. Kachuk's quick hands allowed him to snap that one off and score the goal. The video will reveal here that the goaltender was in excellent position. Sometimes the shot is just so perfect, it's unstoppable. And so he has gotten halfway to the century mark in goals. 50 has always been a magical number in this sport, and he has reached it and play back in. His 50th of the season, scored by number 19, Matthew Kachuk, makes the stop and holds for the whistle. And by number six. And let's hear again from Ray. The goalie's in great position, but he just can't get over quick enough because the one-timer is a rocket. He is fun to watch, isn't he, Ray? We'll do more of that now. The Flames get the draw. Quickly off the stick. That shot hit a man. A collision. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body. Score! He's got his second of the game. No hesitation at all. He fired home that wrist shot. The butterflies of no help to him there. Thought he had the net closed off, but he doesn't. The puck's behind him. Calgary's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. And he gains the zone. Shot. And that's the hat trick. There won't be many on the ice, if any. But he's got three goals. Now, when you talk to goaltenders, they say it's tough to pick up that puck on the backhand. I love scoring these goals. You'd score over the goalie's glove, and you'd say, if you're looking for it, it's behind you. Calgary's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. Another face-off win. I wonder what his percentage is now. It's way up there. That puck left the zone, and so everybody has to drop back to center. Calgary's marching on halfway up the ring. Quick wrist shot. Score! Is it? It is! One more for him! Oh, that shot was heavy and dangerous. Good thing it didn't hit anybody. I always thought the five hole was as good a spot to shoot as any. The goaltender can't really shut it down as the puck squirts through. Calgary's goal has built an even bigger lead. 
We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. Scored by number four, Hayden Flurry. Assisted by number six. Looking to Silverberg. And by number nine. Got it in his own end. Calgary's working ahead from mid ice. Waits from the corner. Approaching the final minute in this game. Play stopped. That puck is just held. They won that draw. Got his stick on it. Looking from the blue line. He gains the zone. Good save there. Drilled. Score! He's got the hat trick. And listen, the only ones you can hear are his teammates. You're not going to see many shots harder than that. What a play. Hudobin's positioning is perfect. He's in the butterfly. He looks like he's got most of the net covered, but that is an outstanding shot. Calgary has taken that neutral zone face off. In the slot. Score! He's got his second. Time of the goal 19 minutes, 13 seconds. When you're in the low slot and a puck's on the backhand, you got to react quickly. The goalie's in perfect position here, just not perfect enough. This is a really accurate shot. And that's a face-off win. Scored by number six, Alex Petrovich. Is right behind the net now. Wheels around behind. Prime of the goal. Seeks the corner. 19 seconds. Driving in from no man's land. Rides the line. A long scorcher. A shot off his head. Yeah, you heard it. It hit him right in the mask. Terrific determination by Fleury. Down to the final seconds of this one. He came in with his score! The hat trick! It's not really loud in here, but they don't expect that. This shot is an absolute laser that finds the back of the net. Nobody saw it until it hit the twine. I thought the goaltender's in perfect shape here. I guess not quite perfect enough as this shot gets into the top of the net off the bar. Calgary's won that neutral zone faceoff. Of the game, scored by number six, Alex Fantastic job in goal tonight. Another shutout. He gets that team win, and he does so with yet another zero on the board. That's it for another great night at a hockey rink. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good evening, everyone.